On this Thanksgiving week in America, I wish you a very, very happy Thanksgiving to you and to your family. I pray this week and all the time that you're in the flow. And I pray that prayer puts you in the flow of divine order. Most of us have times when the demands and the activities of everyday life mount up. Well, that can happen before Thanksgiving. We feel pressed for a time, and then we feel this way, and we let ourselves get in tune in the moment to the harmonizing power of God. And when we allow ourselves just that moment of time where we readjust our soul, we're in the flow. We're in the flow of divine order. And what gives us that moment in time? Well, you know it's prayer. Prayer puts us in the flow of divine order. And before we can make any changes in how we approach life, we turn to God, our source of divine order. We have a daily need for contact with God, just as we have a daily need for air, just as we have a daily need for water and for food. Well, we have a, a divine contact with God, and then we have that guidance come through. A renewal, a refreshing, that doesn't happen during sleep. It is a refreshing of the soul that prayer only brings. And we're revitalized by prayer, and we're able to do all the things that are before us to do in an easy way, because we're in the flow, and we're on time, and we're in order. Prayer absolutely infuses you with an energy of spiritual power. It charges your spiritual batteries. It is accumulative in you. You have a reserve all the time. Prayer helps you establish order in your thinking so that you will do things in the right order, in the right way, in the flow. Prayer keeps you in the flow of divine order constantly. I pray this entire week and this holiday that you are in the flow.